What's going on YouTube? It's me, Johnny8242 here. Back again, believe it or not. <laughs> um, first of all, I'm just going to show some real quick cards. Got this from eBay, Gigard uh, Musasi. National Prize from Leaf. Really cool looking card. So, bought that for pretty cheap. Pretty cool. Um, Bigfoot Silva. Antonio Silva. Uh, Octafractor Autograph. Finest Moments. One of eight. And I believe that's an eBay 101 if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so I don't, it's not going to focus, I don't think, just the shadows and stuff. Make it, but pretty cool card. And next, I did a trade with uh, Jason, aka Poor420, I think that's how you say it. Um, I mean, it's Josh Thompson, first autograph, which is awesome. Needed that from our Josh Thompson PC. Small, but it's getting there. I uh, didn't have that card, so that was pretty cool. Um, it also hit me with, helped me with these. I collect these. Bellator 93 with the uh, Jansen versus Dave. Uh, I'm sorry, um, Dave the Fuser of Jansen versus uh, Marcin Held, which was a pretty good fight. I thought it was a great fight actually. Hakeem Spirit Wolf and uh, Marcus Davis was not such a good fight, but uh, two of them and basically has the lineup on the bottom, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna put those in sleeves as soon as I can. You ship those great, dude. If you're watching, appreciate it. Lewiston, Maine, baby. Anyway, uh, that was awesome. Those came in perfect, which I was really worried because a lot of times things like that can get bent up pretty easily. Also got this off eBay, which I'm going to include earlier, but Brian Stan autograph versus Alessio Sakara. Um, didn't have Brian Stan on anything but a couple cards, so nice. It was 8 by 10 I got it for cheap. The guy had a bunch of Stan stuff. Um, certific uh, certificate of, of Authenticity on the back, which is cool. Not my favorite picture. He had a couple cooler ones, but this one went for very, you know, fairly cheap, so I got that one. Uh, one of the few uh, 8x10s I added in my collection. I'm going to go real quick for the next ones. I've had a couple of old... Actually, all these are from Fight Hobby. I did a bunch of breaks with him. And uh, I'm trying to get these all in order because I did this video once and the freaking audio was making me sound like a chipmunk. I was like... Blah, blah, blah. Not even a chipmunk, man. He sound like a freaking weirdo or whatever. I don't know. But anyway, um, I'll go probably from greatest to least, I guess. I did a break on uh, Series 4. And uh, I got the following cards. Junior Dos Santos Relic. Clay Guida Autograph. Speaking of the devil, what we said earlier, Marcus Davis, the Irish hand today. And Aaron Simpson just got knocked out of the World Series of Fighting by Josh Bergman. And Chris Lytle. So I didn't actually have any of those guys on cards, so I was pretty happy about that. Um, nothing, you know, nothing worth really too much. But, oh yeah, I did get this Alessio Sakara for the unintentional Alessio Sakara PC2 color. A lot of his cards for some reason lately. Um, also, he had a really cool thing, which was uh, you get there's 70 hits or something like that, and you get seven for 20 bucks or something like that. He just did random, and I got some I got some pretty nice cards. Uh, George Roop autograph from Leaf, which is pretty awesome. I'm kind of a big Roop fan. I'm become a Roop fan. Uh, he beat Ruben Duran and uh, facing uh, Brian Boyles at uh, UFC 160. It should be a good fight. Josh Koscheck autograph at 88, which is not too bad. That's not an easy pull, or at least not in the, not in the early product, or the, I'm going to say in the last products, he hasn't really ha had any cards in there too much. Um, Louis Gadno, for the Louis Gadno PC. Um, that's pretty cool. I didn't have that one. Uh, Ivan Ninjavar, first autograph, right on. Matt Mitrion, two color auto relic, which I like that. I'm a big meat, uh, meathead fan. Anthony Johnson autograph, World Series of Fighting two main event winner, which that was a really, really interesting fight to me. Um, also, got the, probably the best one, the Carlos Condit autograph. Did not have him any autographs of him, so I was happy to get that. Um, also got this Anthony Johnson uh, uh, redemption for the card I just showed. So I'm probably gonna give that one away. I don't really need two of those. Um, I don't know who, um, who knows. Uh, what else? Oh, got this break of uh, Moment of Truth. I'll go from least to, in my opinion, least to best. Uh, L, let me find these. They're all kind of jumbled. Oh, here we go. Got Kenny Florian, 80 out of 88, where he's killing Diego Nunez. Look how painful he looks. He looks he's like, like a sick pup. He's like, getting killed. Um, Nathan Diaz. Yeah, what up, Stockton? Yeah, what up? Out of 88. Um, a very forgettable, uh, I'd say this, uh, showdown shots that are very forgettable, Michael Bisping versus, uh, 
Akiyama. I think, what is that, UFC 120? I don't think he wants to remember that. No offense. Um, Frank Murr, unnumbered relic. A Brendan Shaw autograph, which was kind of cool. Um, not that that's anything big, but at least uh, it's an autograph I didn't have on a card. Probably got him on a poster, I'm sure. Vitor Belfa versus uh, Anderson Silva. That's a really awesome and very memorable uh, face off right there with the mask and you're getting each other's faces. It's got a couple different colors, but there's like a lighter shade of black. You can't really tell too much. So I was happy to get that card for sure. And uh, I had the first overall pick in that break. Um, and then I got this card. It's kind of a little weird. Um, I wish this wasn't the first pick because it's a nice card. I mean, I can't complain, but it's not something that I really like all that much. To tell the tape. Randy Couture, James Only Tony. One out of 25, by the way. That's the eBay one of one. If the, the criteria is still the same as I remember it, um, that's pretty cool. That has a lettering and stuff. I'll probably keep that for now. Uh, again, uh, I might sell it. I don't know. Um, that's a pretty cool card. I can't lie. I mean, I can't go, oh man, I hate that I got that. But uh, that's kind of a rough break in general. But uh, Fight Hobby does a great job, man. You guys check him out. FightHobby.com. Check the forums on the site. I post there quite a bit. It's awesome. Great discussion. Um, he also sent in some finest uh, face and number Josh Crispy and Matt Mitchell, uh which that's just pretty cool. I don't know if I was in a break. I really, I gotta slow down. I'm in so many breaks. I can't even remember half the cars where they come from. But uh, that was pretty rad, guys. Um, that's about it for me. I appreciate it. Hopefully this video uploads correctly and I do not sound like I'm harsh. Always remember, never go in the ghetto unless you got one of these. I'm gonna stab you, bitch.